Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Bardot. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac, ooh, ooh. I said cognac, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm your ballet blonde, fabulously dressed. Lane, and we are here at this wonderful event. It's all about the Sloan Kettering Memorial Hospital. And I'm here with this wonderful young lady who is responsible for putting this whole event together, or she's one of the people that are putting it together. Introduce yourself to the camera. Well, I'm Ju my name is Julianne Michelle, and I'm not the only person who is putting it together. Right, I know. A lot of help. We have an excellent host committee, celebrity committee, other chairs, um, and without uh, this restaurant, uh, JB being so generous with us uh, at Church Street Tavern, and the, and the Leonora and Emma Worldwide, who has been uh, coordinating with us since the beginning on this project so this event would never have happened and of course with all the celebrity uh, support that we have and the media yes, you have a, quite a few celebrities here yeah. tonight tell my audience some of the more important people that are attending this event tonight well, so far we have Tina Louise is here um, I, Larry Mamano from King of Queens is on his way uh, Jennifer Esposito is uh, is confirmed to attend um, uh, Dominic Shanice from The Sopranos uh, Stephen Ball Baldwin, I believe. Uh, there's, there's quite a few. Quite a, quite a few people giving their support. And yes. this is a wonderful, wonderful cause for Sloan Kettering. I think, you know, all of us, uh, I hope I hope we can still be audible, yes. but I, I think all of us have been touched by cancer in some way. Oh, I have. That's why I'm here tonight. I have breast cancer. Oh, you do? Yes, about a year ago, honestly, a year yeah. ago, I was diagnosed with breast cancer, stage one breast cancer. Oh, wow. And that's why, you know, I'm I'm very lucky. Stage you, one. Were you, were you they took both my it? breasts off. Uh -huh. I did not go to Sloan Kettering, yeah. but anything that is about cancer, you know, I'm yeah. there. I mean, I'm, I'm a big supporter. We all, I mean, cancer is the number two killer in the
the United States. I know. So, you know, we all have stories. We've all been touched in a personal way by it. And even though tonight's focus is on pediatric cancer research, we are acknowledging all of those who have battled cancer. My late godmother uh, just recently passed away a few months ago My goodness. from cancer. And uh, it's always a struggle to see someone like that suffer, someone who has who's always had so much poise and grace um, and someone I always looked up to. But I still look up to her every day. I think her spirit is with us tonight. So I am so honored to be supporting uh, such an important cause and, and we're doing our best to, uh, to fundraise for them and hopefully we have some great auction items and hopefully people will... Yes, yes I saw the cards. auction items and, yeah. I, and I would like to videotape that later. Yeah. But I want you to tell my audience where we can go to support, where we can go to contribute, and where we can go to participate. What is the website? Oh, the website. Uh, that's a good question. I know if you Google Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center, you'll find their website. And anyone can get involved, and just really simply by Googling Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center in New York, um, there are I'm sure, multiple ways that uh, people can get involved. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Dawn. Uh, thank you. Good thank you. So nice to meet you. Don't go away yet. We'll be back in a moment, darlings. More interviews coming up. Keep watching. Pink champagne kisses. Welcome back, darlings. I'm Cognac Little Lane. I'm here with this very important celebrity, TV personality. She's a big supporter. And we're here tonight for Sloan Kettering Memorial Hospital. I'm here with Rita Cosby. What a pleasure. It's been a while since the summer that we talked to the American Heart Association. Tell my audience why you're a big supporter of tonight's event. You know what? It's very personal to me, Cognac, because my mother in her final months were treated, she was treated at Sloan Kettering. My mother, unfortunately, was diagnosed with lung cancer, and it's an amazing hospital. They took such amazing care of my mother. I'm always eternally grateful, and I always think about when my mother was in her final months, she would see young kids with cancer being wheeled down the halls, and then when she realized that she had had an amazing life and was always praying for the kids, as I was always praying for the kids, as well as my mother, of course. And so when I heard that this event was for the pediatric center at one of the greatest hospitals in the world, I said I have to be here to support them. And I think it's Christmas time, it's holiday time. The greatest gift is to give back and to help a great place. Like Absolutely, I so agree. And that's why I'm here tonight too, because it's been like a whole year for me, because I just found out that I was diagnosed with breast cancer. And by the way, Cognac looks beautiful as ever. You look great. You are you're a living inspiration because I know when I saw you, I also said what a wonderful woman with such a great heart, but you look beautiful and you looked amazing. So you have a lot to be thankful for, but we I adore you. Right. I just want to celebrate. I'm so happy to be here with the Christmas tree and the champagne and the wonderful part of celebrating my life because I... I have so much more to offer. I'm so happy to be alive. Well, and since you're only 30 years old, or at least look like 30, I think Cognac has a long, long time with us and a lot to give. So we're so happy you look beautiful and healthy. So we're celebrating you tonight, too. Thank you, Dolly. Tell my audience where we could go to find out more information, where we can participate, where we can contribute, and where we can support Sloan Kennedy Memorial Hospital. And make sure that you go to the Sloan Kettering website, SloanKettering.org, MemorialSloanKettering.org is the website, and obviously knowing especially that it's going to go to kids, you can even signal it, obviously if you help tonight, but if you go online, say you want to help the kids, obviously all ages. I cannot stress also as a journalist how important it is. We cover so many people who have cancer and how important it is to get funding. They are on the cutting edge of research as well. And because it has touched my family, for me, this is deeply personal and just so special for me to be here tonight. I'm thinking of my parents looking down on me and being here. Thank you, Rita. Thank you so much. Thank you, and happy holidays. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. is wonderful. And we'll be back in a moment, darlings. More interviews right here at this fabulous event, this charity event, the Sloan Kettering Memorial Hospital. Pink, pink champagne kisses. 
Thanks, I'm Cognac Will Elaine, and we are right here at this fabulous event. It's all about this charity event for Sloan Kettering Memorial Hospital. And I'm right here with this very important celebrity who's a big supporter of this event. Introduce yourself to the camera. Hello, Larry Romano. You know me from the King of Queens, Donnie Brasco, lock up in Red Line. And I'm here helping him raise money for this uh, wonderful cause. Tell my audience why you are a big supporter of this charity. Well, the bottom line is, is that this is a, ter a terrible thing to have kids with cancer, you know. And it's a sad day, you know, to see these little kids who never get a chance at having any life at all. And they're suffering and they're going through all this pain. And um, it's something that keeps you up at night thinking about um, how lucky you are and uh, and how unfortunate others are. So the least we could do is be here tonight. That's right. At least we could be here tonight to support this very, very worthy cause. Tell my ladies, what's been going on with you? Anything exciting? Anything new? Yes, I'm producing a feature film that's uh, called Saturday in the Park. It's based on a play that I wrote. It uh, was produced in New York and Los Angeles and uh, very excited about this. We're starting pre-production today and casting January 1st. Fabulous! How exciting for Very you! Exciting, yes. yes, that sounds wonderful. So tell my audience where we could go to find out more information about you. Do you have a website? Do you have a? I got Facebook, Larry tell Romano. Wife, Larry? Larry Romano, LarryRomano.com. I'm on Facebook. I got a, my film company is called Bronx Farm Films. That's our website. You can check it out. You can see the movies that we're making in the future. Excellent. I can't wait to see the film. Awesome. Sounds You're invited. like a lot of fun. You're invited I want to, the to come premiere. to the launch party and the premiere. You're coming all of that. Thank you. Tell my party. audience one more time your Facebook page, Larry Romano. Larry Romano. That's me right here. And LarryRomano.com? LarryRomano.com, yeah. Beautiful. Give me a kiss, too. And we'll be back in a moment, darling. Some more interviews right here. Right here at this fabulous event all about Sloan Kettering Memorial Hospital. Hey, Chef, hey, kiss. Hello, darlings. You've all heard of Marilyn Monroe. Some of you know Bridget Fardell. Well, now it's time for the cognac show. I said cognac, ooh, ooh. I said cognac, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm your ballet blonde, fabulously dressed to impress. One of a kind girl. This has been a Crybaby Productions, darlings.